upstairs, mate. Three inch mark. Two, Scusi, take it and leave it. 27 and an eight. Well, really, you want to measure from the center. Or actually, it doesn't even matter. We don't even have to measure. Just get an idea of how much you want to drop, and then that's the same. We'll compare that to the stock. All right, we'll just, we'll just see it. It was 27 and an eight from the floor. Don't zoom in too much. Ah. I still want a gap because I like girls with thigh gaps. My thighs? And she's a baddie right here, redhead. You want to drop the front an inch too? Or that's too much? I think that's too much. We'll just, I just so, want to leave it at like... A quarter? Drop a quarter, yeah, probably. All right, so let's do a quarter in the front and an inch in the rear. Maybe three quarters? Cause like, it's only, it's only about an inch and a half. Three yeah. quarters would be a lot then. Yeah. So maybe we could all we could always lower three it some other would day. Be three quarters left. It'd be like taking half away of what it's at now. Yeah. I wonder how that'll affect the geometry of this car. But I was like, maybe I'm gonna get. Maybe I'm gonna feel like I'm driving like this now, since right now I'm like used to driving it like this. Yeah. But if it's like set up to have 18s and then 19s in the back, like it's set up to be flat. So when you do play 18s, it might be a little uplifted. The but front, then you right? can always mess with the coil over so it yeah. doesn't affect that. Alright, let's we'll see what happens. I think a square setup is the best thing because I'm not about to be buying different sizes of tires. Yeah, that's annoying. In order to take this one out, it looks like you have to take the reservoir out. Or we can no, use an open-ended yeah, wrench, yeah. but yeah, it'll just, take us forever. A ratcheting wrench. Yeah. Go buy a set today. Today's the day. Today we have the excuse, the necessity. Or we can take out the two, two 10 millimeter bolts. Yeah. And use the impact. It doesn't even really work again. Took it out. I don't even know what I did, bro. It just came out. It's just washer fluid. It's at setting one. Can you access it through there? Do we even have to take it out? Yeah, you can. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. That's way easier than just using a ratcheting wrench. Should we put the bolts back? You know how we love to lose shit. What is this, bro? I don't know. You don't know? <laughs> you don't know? <laughs> you don't know? <laughs> is it a coolant sensor? Right here? Look. Oh. Something you don't need. AC. <laughs> I was like, what the hell? And just like that. Just like that, we found out how fucking much I'm reaching. Damn, Two bro. Two cracks right here. Good thing it's fiberglass. Look. Oh, shit. Yeah, crack right here, crack right here. Crack right here. And then I wonder why I start getting hot quick. Rip. Right. Just move it when we need it. Yeah. Put these bad boys back on. This is where it went? Yeah. Shaft is probably spinning. There we go. That would say if you roll the chair on it. Like this. And then the other one the other way. Let me see, sit on it now. Wait a minute! See, <laughs> compresses. <laughs> so, Sus. Alonso got this out while I was looking for some tools. I'm glad this shit is like easy. Just a couple of bo accessible bolts too, yeah. unlike the steering wheel. Yeah, the steering wheel. Yeah. Uh, well, I'm not sure. Comment down what I should do. Maybe uh, just save them, I guess, if I ever want to go stock. Which, come on, never gonna go want to go stock. Sell them or maybe build something and sell that, or and like a chair or something. A chair would be pretty sick. Now that I'm a welder and shit. Now that I'm a fabricator. You know. Now that I'm a welder and shit. Now that I'm a fabricator. You know. Wait, we didn't really record most of this, but we took out the leaf spring because you don't need it when you have a real coilover. See how this has a, true, a spring? True coilover. As compared to his just a shock absorber. So now we're gonna measure. He wants it. How much? Three quarters. Three quarters of an inch lower. So we lost daylight because we went to go check out one of my old neighbors, RX-7. He was having fuel pump issues. But we also went to Harbor Freight to pick up this socket here. And we're having more issues. <laughs> it was for the coilovers. So we got the tool so we can tighten this piece that hooks up to the top 
pat pretty much. Nice. Very nice. So we were struggling with like a couple of bolts. From the upper control arm? Yeah, they were like stripped or something. So I bought a tap and dice set. The Harbor Freight Special, Pittsburgh. It's actually, just in case you ever have to do it, because it's kind of oh, a common it's, issue. It's a M10 by 1.5. Yeah, 1.5. He, he, uh, with the die, he cleaned up the threads on the actual bolt. And then on the actual uh, chassis, he cleaned up the threads with the tap. Barely. Barely. I did. Yeah. It's just a risky job when you don't know what you're doing. I mean, when well, you're an expert. When you're an expert, you see. I'm sure it's tough regardless. Of yeah. But and then. Oh, and um, we just finished bolting everything down. So everything's on there now. It looks pretty spicy. Oh, look. Silver with silver, red with red. I didn't even notice that. Come on, man. Too bad they're never going to see it. Barely. Oh. <laughs> Oh, brown with brown. Silver with red. Ooh, that's the combo you're going with? We need some red seats. Uh, I'm looking for wheel sponsors too. <laughs> Tire sponsors. Fuck wheel sponsors. Nah, both. Yeah. So now what? Uh, we're gonna put the rear. Oh, yeah, a little chunky. Chunky dunky. Yeah, we'll probably do the rear. Just got out of work in Miss Alice's place to pick up fender roller because I got wheels for the WRX. And they gave me this hat because. Uh, they messed up my order. I'm gonna give it to Savas since he uses hats. Yo, it's good. They gave me this hat. Oh shit. <laughs> my bad. Of course. Easy now. <laughs> Butterfingers. They gave me this hat at JNC, but I don't, I don't use hats. Ooh, spicy. And I didn't have to take out this off. So the, the bottom one didn't have. Oh, it did have a leaf spring, huh? Yeah, I took it out. It was easy. Hell yeah. It was just like a bolt right here, where it sat on. Uh, Wherever it's at. Way easier than uh, oh, it's the like front? Yeah, way easier. It's not like what we oh, uh, like oh, yeah, yeah. And then, so I just took that one off and the same one I said, and then the two. Oh, yeah. And I put back the bracket because I figured, like, I don't know, maybe I can make something off those brackets. I did lower the fuck out of it to put it in. <laughs> oh, but you're gonna raise it back yeah, up? I just figure, like, put it in and then raise it. Yeah. Make it easier. Or fuck it, bro, just slam it. Oh, fuck it. As compared to this one, so it's a, it's gonna be a little compressed when it sits, huh? So yeah. it probably compresses that much right, once it sits. Size, right yeah. So I should be okay. Did you you tie in these already? Um, that one, yeah, not this one. When'd you start? Just barely. Yeah, like an hour. <laughs> yeah, look at my knuckles. They're still dirty. From... I know, dude. That shit. That shit happens to me too. <laughs> yeah, that shit does not come off. I have to start wearing gloves. Gloves, schmubs. I can't feel shit with gloves. Yeah. Nice. More protection it's, it's kits. In. This shit out. This shit was fucking loose. Oh shit! Look at that. And I went to the crash. They could have died. You really could have. And the, did we put it on the vlog that the front um wheel nuts, lug nuts were loose? <laughs> no, I don't Dude, think so. Yeah. Those things were loose too. Hand tied too. I don't know how You're my guy is so lucky. Oh, check. Yeah, that's true. I'm running out of lives here, bro. I don't know, what life are you in the sixth one? I'm, I'm ten. <laughs> what? Don't cats only have nine lives? The next day. I finished it, did the rear. It was pretty easy compared to the front. I slammed it for a bit. It was dead on the floor. Wheel, wheel against... Oh, look, I can see the rubber right here. Yeah. Did so, you drive it like this? Yeah, I've driven it like this. Definitely have to go higher. And then it's a little bit high on the front, but Wait, I do... Did did I'll, you lower this too? Yeah, I lowered this. Remember uh, it was like a monster truck? Yeah, I okay. can. Well, yeah. Or maybe it said you did lower it no, like I a lot. It. And um, did you lower it a lot as compared to what it was or like an inch? Yeah, I left that at an inch. I feel like the front isn't bad. Well, it does rub when I turn. Oh, still? Yeah, I got the sticker yesterday. <laughs> oh, yeah, I saw that shit sick. Yeah, it's coming together. Yeah, how low is the front now? Pretty low. I'm having overheating issues. <laughs> For real? Yeah. I don't know if it's because we spilled the water out. <laughs> that too. The freaking reservoir was empty. Yeah. I'm on coils now. Static. So yeah, it's about uh, two fingers. I've got, I've gone like on that turn, and it, and it feels good though. Way better. It feels good. Like 
Yeah, I don't know. Like I before, had before on that turn when you were racing that one dude, I was like, oh fuck, yeah. we're gonna spin out. No, and I'm um, just like, I haven't even pushed it, but it does feel better. Like, yeah. I don't have tires and I'm rubbing, so I, like, I can't push it. But it rubs a lot, a lot right now. Like or with the yeah, yeah. Oh. So I do have to uh, also make the holes for the dampening. Oh yeah, because I I would have to dampen it. From Let me see, compress it. A murder, tell me what's the secret I'm missing, and I'ma come and get it, and I'ma be in the middle where I love to be. <laughs> oh yeah, so we're static now, boys. I don't think y'all heard a static. I'm static player. I'm static player. I'm static player. <laughs> static player. Yeah. Static player. <laughs> static player. Static player. Static player.